been unreal. Do uh, the open practice, the uh, the locker room sale. Everything's been pretty awesome. You know, uh, got some little gifts from the Oilers too, and then of course this is the cap it off. It's like the best thing ever between Fjord, Joseph, and Roly. This save is one of the most iconic moments in that run, and it's it's etched in my mind, and now it's etched on my arm. So I'm really stoked to have it. It's a sea of orange and blue here at Ford Hall as Oilers Fan Day is taking over Rogers Place as fans from all over oil country are here to take in the festivities ahead of an all-night session at Oilers Training Camp. Let's go Oilers! Let's go! It's amazing how the Oilers let us go in and, and just fool around and Fun day. It's a great day to have everybody coming in and uh, you know exploring Rogers and having lots of uh, activity and obviously family oriented and same for me, decided to bring the little guy in. It's awesome and I like the um, skill one. Uh, yeah, I think it's uh, good for the fans here and yeah I like all the hockey skills and all the challenges here. Awesome, and I get to be around Oilers fans. And second, I love it because there's so much merchandise. It just gets them into the Oilers spirit at such a young age, and you know they love it. And the nice thing about it is there isn't many things around the city that you can do for free. And this is one of them. They've gotten free merchandise, free tickets in, everything. It's just awesome. And also making an appearance here at Oilers Fan Day forward Alex Chason and defenseman Caleb Jones. And as you can see, the fans are taking it all in. Yeah, it's such a dedicated fan base here. Uh, I think it's one of the, the, the first thing I realized last year. Uh, I knew hockey was big in Edmonton, but until you play and you live here, uh, it's a different mindset and I, I really embrace that. I think this is an awesome place to play. It's a, it's a good community and it's great to see everyone that's here uh, today. You know, there's a lot of buzz right now around the city, um, you know, around the organization. Um, you know, it's hopefully going to be an exciting year and um, it's, it's good to see. You know, it's such a passionate fan base and it just makes you excited to uh, kind of get things going. When, when I was up last year and got a little taste, I was able to see the, just the passion and the excitement. And you know, you know, it's still, you know, it's early September, and there's this many people showing up for, you know, the interview and an open practice. So uh, it's definitely really exciting to see. Oh, I, I, I love the turnout. I love seeing all the orange just to get out and interact with different fans and um, just to actually see the Oilers play, which is cool. Oh, it's so exciting here. Yeah, it's, uh, it's great to see these people, you know, get together, having fun, you know, and uh, nice to see all these ex-Oilers too. It was, uh, it was great to get in front of everybody again and, and you know, just how proud this uh, city is of this team and and for us uh, the guys coming back to be able to, to reach to get back to what they gave us uh, especially in the long run we had it's been unreal do uh, the open practice the uh, the locker room sale everything's been pretty awesome you know uh, got some little gifts from the Oilers too and then of course this is the cap it off it's like the best thing ever between Fjord, Joseph and Roly this save is one of the most iconic moments in that run and it's it's etched in my mind and now it's etched on my arm so I'm really stoked to have it. That's uh, first and probably the last time ever, but it was pretty impressive. Uh, whoever did the artwork was its amazing how clear it was and all that. So. And while Dwayne Rolison showed his brilliance in 2006 and onwards for the Oilers in copper and blue, we got new digs here at Oilers Fan Days, which will be available for the upcoming season. Yeah, I like him a lot. I, I think uh, it's going to look great when the, the whole team's wearing it on the ice. Uh, it's going to be uh, really true to the orders. Uh, we were kind of the only team with this kind of color, with the orange and stuff. So, uh, looking forward to, to put the jersey on at the start of the season. And these will be a cool, cool nights too as well. Oh, they're nice. Um, you know, I saw them online, I think about a couple weeks ago, and they look pretty good. But I think in person, uh, they look real sharp. and. 
um, you know, when we get on the ice, um, I think we're all going to look pretty good, and we have it all, and we're all wearing it. So I love it. It's, it's great, and I can only I'm envisioning a mask right now with these colors. So, so, uh, and I know Smitty's pretty creative, so I'm sure he's going to have a lot of fun with these with these colors. So it's going to be great to watch his mask. So it's in with the new, while the history and tradition of the Empton Oilers was on full display here at Oilers Fan Day, and so was the fashion. From Rogers Place, Tony Brar, Oilers TV.